everybody, welcome back to iPot Review. This week we're reviewing Strawberry Twist by Sundial. Or you can maybe call it Calm Strawberry Twist, depending where you look. If you go online here and there, you'll see that they call it Calm Strawberry Twist quite a bit. That's because Calm is their Indica series strains or their Indica strains. Uh, they also have uh, another one that they call Flow and that's their sativa strains. And then they have Ease, that's their CBD stuff. Uh, and they also have Lift, which is their sativa vapes. So yeah, it's maybe a little bit confusing, but oh, whatever. Um, here, their Strawberry Twist, interestingly, is a cross between two strains, the Banana OG and Bubblegum, which are two kind of really interesting strains of their own. So yes, yeah, so we're gonna try this out. So this was grown indoors, by the way, in Alberta. And uh, yeah, so let's give this a try. Oh yeah. All right, so before we get to the unboxing, I wanna talk a little bit about price. So the price here is going to be $40.95 for 3.5 grams. Works out to be $11.70 per gram. And also they tell us that the THC on here is going to be, if you look on the jar, it's 222 milligrams per gram. So there's a thousand milligrams per gram. So 222 milligrams would be 22%. So that's how we figure that out. Anyway, so we're going to move on to the unboxing now. So you can check it out. We're gonna uh, show you. It comes in a little blue container, as you've seen, and it is recyclable according to the label underneath. It's got a recycling label one, so you can always check with your municipality or return it to your local cannabis retail store. Anyways, once you remove the freshness seal, you get to see, check it out, a little Integra Boost Humidity Pack. Kind of cool, I like that, 62%. Uh, a bunch of tightly packed nuggets there, and then maybe just the smallest amount of shake worked out to be 3.48 grams that's uh, just 0.02 grams off from 3.5 so that's pretty good anyways the um, smell here when you open it up is kind of like a sweet fruity spicy smell love this little humidity pack when you grind up these buds though i find that that's when the the smell really comes out really really fruity really really nice A little bit like strawberry anyways if you vape it you'll probably really smell those fruity terpenes or you'll taste those fruity terpenes the hydro pack really helps in terms of uh, keeping this bud very nice and perfectly humid at the right temperature or at the right humidity level anyways and we also get to see the buds it's a really nice dense medium-sized buds there's hardly any shake uh, maybe five or six buds, six, seven buds there. That was nice. Uh, for 3.5 grams, you'd expect that they'd be kind of medium small, but they're all really nice. Uh, groom and yeah, it kind of looks good from afar. So we're actually going to zoom in a little bit, see if we can get any more information by going into macro mode. Uh, here we're going to see like these are dark green buds and you get to see all these orange hairs up close. Really, there's lots of little trichomes there. So you get to take a look at that. Now, aside from a few exceptions though, when we zoom in, you can notice that a lot of those trichomes are headless. Now that could be for a multitude of reasons. It could be uh, for sure part of an irradiation process, um, which people, a lot of people say that it will have an effect on the trichome heads. It could be also like maybe it got knocked around during the packaging or shipping. But anyways, you can make up your own hypothesis not saying what happened here but we can all just imagine so now as far as the buzz goes i would say that this is a super strong body buzz it's gonna get you really in my opinion very high and it does kind of make it hard to focus i find it's hard to really even do this video i'm on now take three so to give you an idea and i'm really just having a hard time uh, just keeping my, my focus, if anything. I think this is probably something that would be better to just chill out in front of the TV. Um, if you have something to do, you may want to get it done first uh, because it is kind of, you know, that kind of buzz. Just saying. Um, as far as it goes though, you know, 
this is so this is gonna be my opinion I mean I yes I would recommend this by the way as far as the quality to the price and buzz ratio this is actually really kind of top-notch it works out to be something like 53 cents per THC when you divide the price per THC um, so that's kind of a really good deal as far as it goes. I mean, I've gone back in my, the history of all the videos that I've, or the different strains that I've reviewed over the year and a bit that I've been doing this. And this was, you know, one of the top best pricing. So yeah, as far as it goes, I would recommend this. Um, if you haven't tried it already and the flavors bang on. So yes, it makes it worth it in my opinion. Um, so yes, this is my review. I'm gonna wrap it up here. Thank you guys so much for joining me once again for another review. If you guys haven't done it already, make sure you subscribe. And uh, yeah, I'll check you out next week. Or check, <laughs> I'll be here next week for another review. Check you later. What? I can't even finish this video. <laughs> Thanks for joining me. See you next week. Check you later. Is that a good ending?